welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Nastasha. If you're new here, I'd love it if you would subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. Also, don't forget to follow me over on my Instagram for all of the home decor must-haves and sneak peeks. Usually post everything on Instagram before I post it on the channel. So it's always a fun time over on my Instagram. So make sure to head over there. I will have the link in the description box down below for you guys to check out. So for today's video, I'm sharing with you guys some more new products in Ikea for the new year. I hope you guys enjoy this video. As always, if you do, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And without further ado, we can just jump right into it. Okay, so the first thing that completely caught my eye is this new round black coffee table. I originally just absolutely loved the round shape of it and like the overall like shape that it has, but I love the fact that it has the marble effect insert at the bottom piece. So it's basically like a faux marble look. I feel like Ikea does the faux marble so well. It doesn't look cheap at all. It's a really great option if you're looking for like a faux marble piece. They've been doing a lot more recently. So if you're looking to get that marble look, without breaking the bank. This is a really great option for you. This coffee table is actually under $200 in the US. So I think it's a really great option and I love the color of it. Next, they did actually add the same marble effect to the Besta. You guys know the Ikea Besta is one of my absolute favorite pieces. It's probably like my number one favorite aside from the Hovet mirror. I think it's a great option to have for a media console, if you want extra storage, if you need a buffet. There's so many different pieces in this collection that you can have. And I love the marble effect on the doors. They always had the like faux concrete, but now that they have like the faux marble effect, I love it. Definitely actually thinking of snagging two of the doors in that marble effect. That way you can just add them to the Besta. That's another cool thing about the piece. If they ever come out with new doors that you want, you can just replace the ones you already have on your piece, which is always a great option. All right, next I saw an ad for these on Instagram and I was like, oh my gosh, these are so cool. So it's super important to have some form of air cleaner within your home. I feel like that's a very big thing that a lot of people are lacking within your home. Make sure you own at least a few air cleaners for each of your rooms. It's super important to keep the air clean within your home. And this is actually a table with a built-in air cleaner. So I thought it was super cool because sometimes air cleaners can be like an eyesore or they just kind of like look like a random piece within your home. And this one is cool because it's actually a table. So it's like a two in one. And again, for it being a combination, I don't think it's super expensive to me. It's at a good price point for what it is. So if you don't have an air cleaner in your home or if you're looking for something that looks a little bit more aesthetically pleasing, definitely go for that piece. Next, they have so much many new arrivals in terms of sofas and they are all amazing. They're very mid-century modern on a budget. So if you're in the market for a new sofa, these are definitely some really great options to take a look at. This one in particular, I just love the subtle curve shape that it has. It's very subtle. It's not like the over the top curved shape. So I feel like it still will fit in within your home and it can be styled many different ways. So I think that this is a really great sofa option if you're in the market for a new one. Next is this shelving unit and this is actually one of their yellow tags. If you didn't know what a yellow tag is, it means it is the cheapest item in that particular category. So this thing comes in at $24.99, which is a great deal for under 25 bucks if you need some sort of storage. Actually thinking of getting one of these to put outside to store everything that I need for outdoors. Because it is metal, it will hold up really nicely outside, but obviously if you just need like a really small, sleek and minimal bookcase or bookshelf, or if you wanted to add the, you know, decorative bookshelf look into your home, but you don't want to break the bank, this is the perfect option for you. Next is this bed, and this bed is absolutely beautiful. I'm kind of kicking myself because it actually took me quite some time to find a new bed. And when I was looking, I was looking for something exactly like this bed frame. I wanted the fabric headboard and I wanted the legs to be either wood or metal just because it tends to be a little bit more durable. And this one is perfect. It's only $149 for the queen size, which is so affordable for this look. Like this looks like a much more high end bed. So because of that, I just think this is a great option for under 200 bucks to have just like that sleek modern look. And I'm actually hoping to pick one of these up to kind of gift to someone for a room makeover soon, just cause I think that they're such a great option. All right, as I mentioned, they had a bunch of great sofas, but they also have some really great love seat options. So if you're in like a studio apartment or if you're looking for something a little bit on the smaller side, I would definitely recommend this love seat in the velvet. I absolutely love this new collection. So it also comes in a sofa version and the sofa version with the chase 
basically looks exactly like my West Elm sofa, but it is half the price of what my West Elm sofa now costs. Over the years, they've kind of raised the price, so this Ikea one is definitely a really great option if you just want to get that look for less. 50% off of the price and it literally looks exactly the same. Comes in a few different configurations as well. So if you're in the market for like a sectional or something that's more of like a combo in that, you can definitely find the right configuration for your home. All right, another best option that came out that I'm absolutely in love with. This one is the like wood slat look. Now a ton of people have been doing like DIY Ikea hacks and they've made these doors themselves. To me, it's a more like tedious project. Sure, if you wanna do the DIY, that's great. But now they're adding it to the Besta. So basically you don't have to pay for any of the DIY supplies and it's already done for you. I love the look of this. I think it's amazing. I also like it shown here on the black with the wood slat look. I love that. So again, if you're looking for some sort of console or buffet or any of those things, definitely check out the new best option. All right, when I saw this sideboard, I immediately fell in love with it. And my only suggestion, if you pick this up, all you have to do to make it look a hundred times more expensive is to change the knobs on it. I think the knobs are what makes it a little bit cheap looking. Of course, if you want that look of the same color all over, that would work, but I just think that the wood on the knobs matching the whole piece doesn't look that great. So if you remove those, I think it would be amazing. You can put something a little bit more modern and you can make the piece look so much better. So that's definitely an option. I'm actually in the market for a sideboard right now, actually considering that one since all I would have to do is switch out the knobs and it is pretty reasonable for a sideboard. Next is this plant pot. It's only five bucks and to me, just the design on it looks really good. It's giving me a major like anthropology West Elm vibes, but for five bucks, you're definitely not gonna find a planter at West Elm or anthropology in that price range. So definitely shop there for planters. They have a ton of great options, but just the overall design on this one really caught my eye. Next is this beautiful new cushion cover. It has like that velvet sheen to it. I absolutely love adding just nice textures. I tend to stay away from pattern for my pillows on my sofa more recently. And I love this one because it's like a nice little velvet. It would make a good combo with, they have this like linen like pillow. If you layered both of those on your sofa, it would look so nice. So definitely a great option. I love this new color. It's like a sagey green and I just think it's great for the upcoming spring season. Next is this really cool floral vase. It's just like very unique, giving me major H&M home vibes. You guys know that whole collection that they have. To me, this looks like a piece right out of it. It is $12.99, which isn't bad. And I think this would be great, especially styled on a bookshelf or like a bookcase or you can use it in your entryway. It's just very minimal and sleek, but it has like a really nice curved design to it. All right, next I thought this little bamboo laundry basket was really cool. It has the liner to it. Ikea has a bunch of amazing, really great basket options, but I thought this one looked cool for a laundry basket in particular. If you don't have any room to put your laundry basket anywhere else besides your bedroom, this is the perfect option for you because it will fit right in with most people's decor and it doesn't look like a complete eyesore. It's kind of like hidden and it looks super cute. So I thought that was a great addition to the new collection. All right, next up is this dining table. If you guys didn't remember, I've had this dining table probably like four or five years ago and I had the white version. Now they make it in black. This looks so sleek, so modern. It looks like it's from CB2, but it's not. It's from Ikea, it's super affordable. I'm actually in the market for a dining table right now. I've ordered three of them in the past month and they all had to be canceled because they're not delivering for another like six months. Just don't wanna wait that long. So I think I might get this one from Ikea because it's seriously so affordable and I feel like you can make it kind of look a little different if you want with a fun DIY project. So I'm probably more than likely going to be picking this one up. And again, I really recommend it. The quality on this table is really good for the price. All right, next I saw this plant mister and I thought it was so cute. Again, giving me kind of like Urban Outfitters vibes, a really great option if you have plants like me and you want to just have like a cute little plant mister. I saw that and I just thought it was a cute item to pick up. All right, next up is this glass vase, but it has like an olive green tint to the glass. 
Definitely gonna be snagging one of those. It's gonna look perfect on my entryway. You can put a little bit of water and some fresh flowers in it and you're good to go. But I absolutely love the unique color on the glass. It really stood out to me. So I would highly recommend one of those. The glass vases at Ikea are always really good quality. All right, and then this next vase reminds me of an H&M home vase I had a few years back. So many of you guys asked about it and it sold out super quickly. This one has like that fluted glass look and it has a cool metal top to it. So you can kind of have it like where you put a whole bouquet of flowers. You can put the single flower if you use that little metal top to it. Really cool, really unique, love the design. This is definitely one of the pieces from Ikea you should pick up. It looks really luxurious and it's on a budget. All right, and then last but certainly not least, this cane table lamp stood out to me immediately when I saw it because I thought that this would be the perfect thing to add to a home but spray paint it black. If you spray paint this cane lamp black, it is going to look 10 times more expensive than it does in the cane. I just feel like the tone of the cane looks a little bit cheap, but you can literally add a layer of spray paint to this you can even make it white and it would look amazing so that is another thing from this that i'm definitely picking up when i go to ikea I'm just gonna throw a little coat of black spray paint on there and it is going to look amazing so those were all of the new items i wanted to share with you guys from ikea for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed this video as always if you do don't forget to give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you guys haven't already thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys in my next video bye